Hey y'all and welcome back to the homestead. So this is going to be a really fun video. I'm excited to film it. Today is actually Tyler's birthday. So y'all make sure to tell him happy birthday and show him some love. We just got back home. We've been just kind of spending the day out doing some things that he likes to do. Um, we went and had breakfast with his parents. We ran some errands. Uh, we went shopping a little bit. And then we also went to Walmart to get a few things. We were going to go out to eat for his birthday tonight, but the restaurant we were going to go to, they don't open until later, and so we decided we're going to cook at home tonight, and then we'll go celebrate out on the town another night. But we went to Walmart to eat a few things. Um, instead of a birthday cake, Tyler wanted a birthday pie. So we're going to try and uh, make a buttermilk, a southern buttermilk pie. So I thought I would do kind of like a little unbag grocery haul with you and kind of show you what we got. Um, first, I just got a little happy birthday thing for him. He picked this one out. We'll try and put that on top of the pie. Um, it called for some ground nutmeg, so I had to get one of these. We weren't really sure if we had any of these or not, so we went ahead and picked one up. Uh, it called for a lemon. It needed the juice and the lemon zest. Uh, it also called for a pie crust that was unbaked. Usually I get the, just like the pre-made graham cracker if I'm going to make like a simple pie. But I want to follow the in, um, the directions uh, just since I've never made it before. So we only got one of these. It comes with two in a package, but we're just going to make one tonight. Let me sit that there. Oh. The original recipe does not call for this, but Tyler thinks this will be good, and I think it will be too, um, to go on the pie, especially since it has lemon. I think that's going to be good. But we're going to put some blueberries in there too, so I think that's going to be fun. And knowing that it comes with the lemon, you know, lemon and blueberry, those always go really, really well together. Uh, we got some whipped cream to go on top. And then, of course, if you're going to have a buttermilk pie, you got to have some buttermilk. So those are the things that we had to get at the store for his birthday pie. Now, for his birthday dinner, we have had these one time before, and they are amazing. Um, I'm pretty sure I have a video where I made these. It's been a while, so if I can find it, <laughs> I will link it below so you can see it. But we got some of these lamb seasoned leg steaks look at that beautiful but y'all these are absolutely amazing like one of the best steaks we've ever had um one day we really 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 want to get sheep for our farm uh we just have to make sure we have all the right equipment for them but sheep will definitely be on our farm and lamb is definitely gonna be a plus for our freezer we're so excited and then, of course, to go with steak, you need steak fries. <laughs> I was kind of laughing because usually every time me and Tyler, we go to like Texas Roadhouse, it's our favorite. We always get the steak and fries. And so we're going to kind of recreate that here tonight. Um, and I was laughing because I was like, you know, most people, they want like a baked potato. I said, but we want French fries. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to go ahead and put these things away until we're ready to cook them. And then I'll just bring you all along with us as we kind of have a fun evening. Happy birthday. Thank you. I love you. Love too. I think these puppies love you too. Yeah, they're wet. yeah it's raining, so they're wet. <laughs> she says, happy birthday. You want to show us what you got for your birthday? Uh... Yeah. Okay, what did you get? The, um, Dad got me this carbon set. That's really cool. I don't know what they all are, but <laughs> he, my dad used to carve, so. Yeah, that's going to be really I guess fun. I'm going to make it. You're going to try your hand at it? Yeah. <laughs> well, what would you tell me that you wanted to make out of it? What was that one thing you wanted to do? Um, maybe try to make like a little marionette sheep or something. That would be fun. And these should help you do that, right? I mean, if I can do it, I don't, I don't know if I can do it. And then we went to Hobby Lobby, and he just got some of these um, wood blocks so he can try it out. Something else that Tyler got for his birthday, I actually found this for him. He loves elk meat. And where we're at, you don't really see a lot of it. 
well, one, you don't see many elk, and then two, most restaurants don't have elk meat. But I was on Amazon, and I found this elk summer sausage, and it was a pretty good deal. You get three things of it, and we went ahead and <laughs> opened it first thing this morning because I gave it to him when we woke up, and it is really, really good. So if y'all like elk and you can't get any, check out your Amazon because I think I even saw elk steak on Amazon, but it was a little pricey. This was <laughs> more affordable. What? You got dirt on your face. How's it going? I kind of. <laughs> Did you find something online to kind of mimic? I like the sheep. Oh, that is cute. But I don't know if I can do it. Okay. Well. I used to watch my dad carve things and it was effortless. Yeah. Well, maybe once you do it for a little while, you'll kind of get the hang of it. Because I think this would be a really fun hobby. That would be fun. I'm not artistic in any way whatsoever, but I will support you in this, okay? It's a cheap <laughs> hobby. That's kind of nice. <laughs> yeah, we guys got these at Hobby Lobby, and they were 40% off. My hobbies are usually expensive. Expensive. <laughs> Does anyone else have a husband that does his woodworking projects inside? It's raining and wet. So that gives the excuse to have wood shavings all over the floor? Yeah, he'll clean it up later. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Mosey's like, I'm so glad you're home, Dad. I'm just going to hang out with you. And yeah, he's my little shadow. He's your shadow. He's so cute. Look at his big old tail. <laughs> Tyler, are you going to cook the steak, or am I going to cook the steak? Oh, I can do it. You want to do it now? 
No, I was just trying to figure out who was cooking it. I can do it. I did it last time, didn't I? No. You didn't? You no, did. I did do it last time. Not the lamb. I did the lamb. Because we've only done it one other time, and I did but it But it was video. extra good. Yeah, that means I made no, it. No, no. Yeah, it's because I made it. The butter's really hot. You need it ready? Uh, yeah. sear? All you gotta do is this is a moment of sear and then you turn it all the way down. So sear on all four sides. Should I take this off? This, this you can or you can leave it, it doesn't matter. Will it sear into the meat? Sure. Will Why it be alright? Sure, it's fine. Okay, here we go. Meat side or fat side first? It doesn't matter. Just... <laughs> Want to move, move them all at the same time that way they're not burning. Oh, man, yeah, you can smell. That smells amazing. As soon as they touch the pan. <laughs> Our plan with this is to let these sear on all sides for just a couple minutes. Then we're going to turn it way down and we're going to let it cook low and slow. That looks really good. You can take that sprig off so you don't cut through it. <laughs> I don't think that's done. Oh yeah, see that's not that part's not done. No, that's still pretty raw. Okay. Right. Yeah. That's I think, when we're done. Yeah, I think these are good. Alright. Let's, let's do this. Bring it over it. This what? <laughs> Trying to remember which side was yours and which side was mine. <laughs> They're all the same right now. Alright, so we had to cut these up. I think y'all saw that. Just because they were kind of taking forever. They're thick. They're thick. Probably They're should thick. have cut them before we cooked them. Yeah. So now it's like we have little nuggets. That's a big one. This is a big nugget right here. That's plenty for me for now. Alright. I'll come back and eat the rest, you know. Okay, I'm sure. <laughs> and then I'll take that one. Is it? Yeah, that's where I want to start. Okay. Alright. I kind of feel bad that we had to cut these up before they were done, since now the presentation's not perfect. Yeah, they look like mini roasts. <laughs> but I'm telling you, they don't taste like a mini roast. We already tasted one, or we took a bite of one. It was pretty good. I'll tell you too, um, the fat on lambs mm -hmm. are, like beef fat is not that good to me. Right. But the fat on these men are so good. Yeah, these are delicious. All right, y'all, we're going to go and enjoy this dinner, and then I'll bring y'all back when we try that um, dessert for his birthday. There you go. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Tyler. Happy birthday to you.
Woohoo! You made it look really good. Thank you. Make a wish. Yay! Yay! <laughs> now let's slice her up. Okay. You ready for a taste test? Yep. There you go. Mm. What's that a layer of in there? I'm not really sure. Just kind of layered out, didn't it? <laughs> this is our first time ever trying this kind we of have pie. No, did you try it? No. So we have no idea what's We have no like. idea. It's what? lemony. Yeah. It called for uh, lemon juice and lemon zest. I just totally looked at a picture and pointed at it. <laughs> I kind of liked your idea of the blueberries with it because blueberries and lemon usually go together. What do you give it? I like it. Do I you, give it a 10. You do? Yeah, yeah. I, I like it. And it's kind of like a fresh uh, thing. It kind of tastes fresh. Instead of like real heavy and stuff like some pies can be? Yeah. Yeah. Like light and refreshing? It's got a fresh thing to it. Awesome. The, the lemon kind of makes it meringue you know? Oh, okay. Well, cool. So we recommend they try this. Yeah. Okay, cool. Well, I hope you had a really happy birthday, and I love you. I did. Thank you. I love you, too. All right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.